Orange County registered digital. Mission Viejo storms into the Pac-5 quarterfinals, averaging 48 points per game. And somehow Rawlinson never gets trucked. Must be the power of the stash. To the game. Halfway through the first, Diablo's going for it. Tight end Daniel Marks hauls it in. To the second quarter where Big Red steps up. Specifically, Matthew Rocket. He finds an opening and blasts off. We are tied. So we just saw Rocket. Now it's time for Lockett. Jonathan Lockett picks off the pass and goes all kinds of PlayStation 4 and Xbox One crazy, busting out some next-gen moves. This sets up an eventual throw from Chase Forrest to Jacob Welch. He smashes his way into the Smurf turf. Monarch's up 14-7. And Rocket's at it again, keeping his feet in bounds for the interception. Later, the handoff goes to London Iacopo. A three-yard score, and Modern Day leads 21-7 at the half. The Diablos only have three first downs in this game, but their defense keeps them in it. The Beast, Michael Matthews, and teammate Joe Babros do their best to keep it interesting. Forwarding to the fourth, fourth and seven, but Iacopo is there to break it up. Keyshawn Johnson is like, come on, man. The Diablos finally break their scoring drought with 42 seconds left in the game. Quarterback Ian Fieber finds Connor Hill, but it wasn't enough. Modern day advances 21-14. I mean, our defense played well. Uh, you know, they had a lot of good receivers, and I think our secondary stepped up. We wanted almost, in a sense, take the first punch, hit them as hard as we can. And, you know, we knew the team, we knew what we were doing going in, and that was the game plan pretty much, just get on them early. We weren't even supposed to make it to the playoffs. People doubted us after Bosco, but, you know, we, we had a mindset that we're not done yet. You know, we still have things to prove, you know, people to show up. You know, we're back. I thank the Trinity League for this win because we have to battle every week for every inch. That was business as usual for modern day. A bit of redemption for modern day tonight. You see, the Monarchs lost to the Diablos in 2010. Some of these players were freshmen back then, so they told me after the game that it felt good to avenge that loss. Modern Day now heads into the next week where they will play Long Beach Poly in the semifinals. The Jackrabbits actually beat the Monarchs last year in the CIF championship game, and bloodlines run deep. London Iacopo has cousins on that Long Beach Poly team, including five-star recruit Juju Smith. Will Modern Day's road to redemption continue? Reporting from Santa Ana, I'm Jonathan Camus for OCVarsity.com. Orange County Register. We are here in the service of Orange County.